Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Um, thanks for showing interest in me or my shopping experience, whichever one you're here for, thanks. Um, I'm literally, I'm so thirsty, like it took me so long to do this makeup because I just had no idea what I was doing. Can you guys see my face? Like is it dark over here? I don't know. I'm over it. Anyway, thanks for clicking on the video. Let's get into the reason why you're here. Sephora! I'm excited. I love going to Sephora. I mean, like, everybody loves going to Sephora, right? I have some snacks over here. Because I got hungry. Don't you get hungry when you do your makeup? Like... It's like a thing. It's like a known fact. Okay, so I went to Sephora to get a foundation. But literally, like, they have like 40 shades. And I think they had like every single shade in stock. Except for the shade I believe was best for me. And the shades like before and after that. Like, literally, I was like, you know what, maybe I can do, like, uh, maybe I can get, like, one shade darker or one shade lighter, darken it up, lighten it up a little bit. Like, no. No. They said no, Cap. Not for you. Not today. Not today. Come back next time. So, I'm going to come back. So... I'm sorry, I'm like pulling some stuff out of here because it's just like stuff I'm going to tell you guys at the end because like it's really not important at all. Marc Jacobs Highliner. This one is Pink of Me. Pink of Me. I love his highlighters. I had a black one and I lost it. Like, it was like a year ago though, so... I'm not really mad at myself for losing it. Anyway, I love these. They're super cool. They're, they're twist ups. I think you can take this off. Oh, there's a sticker on here. Okay, we're not gonna get into that, but you can take this, uh, the end off, and it's like a little sharpener. I love it so much. They're like super, super smooth have a hella pigment and they're just like they're perfect they stay there forever too so the black one of course I was like obsessed with it I'm sorry I'm just throwing everything I got another one this one is Deja Blue I like that name same thing super super pigmented stays forever super cute color I wanted to get two light pastel colors because I'm getting kind of tired of using this um, NYX Wonder Pencil in my waterline. Like, I want something light but not white because that looks kind of scary sometimes. Okay. I guess we're just going to, let's just get out Mark Jacobs products because I'm going to get tired of saying his name. Okay, and then we have a lip gloss and a lipstick. I think I bought these to go to... No, I didn't. I didn't. I meant to, though. I definitely meant to. The lipstick... Lipsticks and lip glosses, same thing as the um, liner is. Super, super smooth. Like, honestly... And their lipsticks, actually, they stay... They're smooth, they're not like matte by any means. They're definitely like a more creamy finish. But their stay power is a lot longer than a regular creamy lipstick. If that makes sense. I don't know what is in their formula. Oh and look, it like it's like a magnet. It's so cute! Ah! This is just like a nudie color. This gloss is called Taboo, and it's just gorgeous, honey. 
And I was definitely supposed to put on a gloss before I started filming, so. Over it. But like, look at this goodness though. What is my camera focusing on? Cause it's not me. Like, I don't know what my camera's doing right now. But you guys see this. You guys see it though, right? I feel like that just looks really ugly on camera. But go, go your ass to Sephora and look at this. It's cute. <laughs> my dog's having a blast right now with all these little makeup boxes going around. He's living his life, honestly. Paying no mind. No mind. I have an hour to film this video because I need to go pick up my niece from school. <laughs> And I was late, I was late picking her up from school last time. It wasn't my fault that I was late, but like I still feel bad for it. So. <laughs> I'm not gonna name any names, but. Sorry. My next product is this Kat Von D finishing powder. No, it's not a finishing powder. It's a blotting powder, which I didn't realize before I bought it, so. So fuck me. Um, I got the shade light. Um, this is obviously not for my entire face because I would look ridiculous. <laughs> but I wanna see how it would be um, setting the under eyes and giving it like, if it would give it some brightening power or I don't know. Honestly, this is probably a bad purchase. But I did get the locket setting powder though, the loose one, which I know is an actual setting powder because it says it. I kind of like dropped the fuck out of it in the store. So I'm kind I'm really I'm really shocked that it's I'm really shocked that it's like not broken or anything. I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to say anything about it right now from this little type test that I just did because I don't want to get my hopes up. I don't want to get y'all hopes up. Packaging kind of looks cute with like the KVD, but it feels it feels kind of like cheap to me. Like when I'm opening it and closing it, I feel like I can break the top with my hand. I don't know, I'll use it in my next tutorial. Maybe I'll do like a, fa a full face of like first impressions or something. That'd be cool. Let me know if you guys want to see that because that would be fun. Next, I got a Bobbi Brown gel eyeliner pot. Just super simple. Wow. I got it in the wrong color. But I mean, who doesn't need a black eyeliner though? I want. I meant to get the brown one, but... But you guys see it. It's just a simple black gel pot. And these are like the... I feel like everybody needs a, a black gel liner because it works for so many different things. Like, you can use it as an eye base for your eyeshadow if you want to do a black smoky eye or even uh, like a bright blue or purple smoky eye you can put a black base underneath it so that the powder on top can pop out more this is the first product that I grabbed this is an hourglass I believe highlighting stick flash highlighting stick yes in the shade flash in the shade gold flash Super cute, similar packaging to the foundation sticks. I just believe that the foundation sticks has black packaging all the way through instead of silver. But um, let me do it. I ran out of space on here, so let me do it here. This is like beautiful. I want to hit my little, my little nose. Oh my god. <laughs> oh 
I'm so over my life right now. How long? How long? Honestly, you guys. We have one more lipstick from the Too Faced Peach Collection. This is actually my first product from the Peach Collection. So I'm excited about it. Um, it's in the shade Doll Face. It's basically another, like, just nudie, nudie peach color. It's a lot more light and peachy than the Marc Jacobs one. You see, this is Doll Face from Too Faced. And this is whatever the Marc Jacobs one was called. Cream and Sugar. I'm sorry, I'm like unboxing this. This is a Too Faced melted lip gloss. This is the clear one, Girl on Tap. Oh, I just hit my camera. I was about to say I don't know where to swatch this because like my hand's doing a whole lot of stuff right now. But I mean it's clear lip gloss. It looks like clear lip gloss. And now this stuff is just stuff that like everyone wastes their money on. There's like face mask and fucking ultra repair cream that you just need to get. And I just really had to get it, so I got it. I got some pore stuff, you know, some pore strips from Dr. Jart. And then also from Sephora's collection. These some um, lip mask because you gotta keep your lips popping. You dig? I didn't buy this. I don't even know what this is. Instant firming beauty shot. Keep young and beautiful. Okay, so I guess it's um a firming serum. That's cool. And then I got this intense hydration moisturizer to force my boyfriend to use it. Okay, and then I just got a brightening hydrogel mask. I have oily skin, but I'm really into like keeping my skin hydrated just because I'm scared of wrinkles. Like soup, like like super 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 scared of wrinkles y'all thank you god you guys okay that's it though that's everything thank you guys so much for watching i hope this was like interesting i hope i didn't rant too much i have to go pick a five-year-old up from school so Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a blessed rest of your day. Mwah. Please tell me other videos. Do you guys want a video on this look? Do you guys hate this look? Do I look stupid? Tell me. Please give a thumbs up and subscribe. Subscribe. Please. Like, it's just rude to watch somebody's stuff and not subscribe. Do you guys look at it? Oh my god! <laughs> My mom just sent me a picture of herself saying, girl, your mama cute. My mom is like my best friend, you guys. She's probably going to text me while I'm filming every video. Uh, those are crystals. Don't disrespect me like that.